Let's finish off our conversation with Alvin Kamara, last year's Offensive Rookie of the Year. Here's his quote to Bleacher Report, talking about them losing the last seconds of that heartbreaking loss on the road to Minnesota and the divisional playoff last year. We'd beat the blank out of the Eagles because we was rolling. If we won against the Vikings, I knew nobody was going to stop us because we came all the way back. I mean, you can say whatever you want. Will, if I was 6'8", I'd be in the NBA. I can say that, but nobody can prove it. I mean, is this a ridiculous comment? Do you, do you believe that this is something that uh, would have transpired Would they have beaten the Eagles? Well, I mean, first of all, let's talk about the logic. He's like, we came all the way back against the Vikings, so no one could beat us, except the Vikings beat you. Yeah. Like, you literally <laughs> immediately lost as soon as you came back against the Vikings. Somebody beat you. So to say that you wouldn't have beaten the Eagles, who were a team that just kind of caught fire, couldn't feel their face, had Nick Foles, had to throw a hail, you know, a flea flicker touchdown passes in the NFC Championship game, that's kind of silly. Also, the Saints would have been outside in a rough environment. I don't think that they definitely roll into Philly and dominate that team. That's a good Philly defense in a very good Philly offense. Now, that being said, I mean, yeah, sure, New Orleans could have gone in there and win. One, Minnesota could have gone in there and won. They all, you know, Case Keenan doesn't throw that pick six. Maybe they do it. I, I just, I think I get what Alvin Kamara is saying. The Saints are great. But the one red flag, real red flag to me about this is that the Saints might be thinking about last year and not about this year. And that's something that coaches talk about all the time. Bill Belichick catches guff for it because you know, we're turning the page, we're on to 2018, but you have to do that. If you're stuck thinking about a tough playoff loss and what could have happened last year, then you aren't going to win this year. And so I don't think the Saints as a whole are doing that, but it is a bit of a red flag for me in that sense. Great point, and many great points as always. Thanks a lot, Will. Appreciate your time. And you get more of Will in the Pick 6 podcast. Download it, iTunes, SoundCloud, wherever you get your pods. As we creep into the preseason, week one really starts tonight. And, of course, we are just gearing up for the regular season starting a month from today.